Hey everybody, it's opening night and it's Artslandia.com. We're at the opening night of Giselle. It's Oregon Ballet Theater's brand new offering and it's here at the Keller Auditorium. <laughs> Norman, Karina, tell us what you thought. Amazing. Everything about the show. Stunning. The, the dancers were just stunning. They were beautiful. Oh, yeah. And Karina's kind of a Giselle aficionado, so... It's my favorite ballet. Oh, really? I've seen it many, many times. I love the music. I love everything. And this was a beautiful production. Oh, oh it was so beautiful. The movements. The dancers are just so wonderful. They did such a good job. It was very moving. Oh, wonderful. Now this whole season is called Affairs of the Heart. Did, was your heart, uh, did you feel as if an affair of your heart took place? Definitely. I mean, even though the ballet, you don't hear any words, you feel it in just the movements of the dancers. And it's just so beautiful. It's something that you don't even need words. So um, tell now, were you familiar at all with the story of Giselle before coming in? No, no I read the uh, really brief synopsis on the um, website or something. So I had a really little tiny idea about it, but no, I hadn't heard about it. Uh, and when I did catch up on the story at intermission, uh, I realized <laughs> that, that program. Oh, that's what that happened. A lot of a lot of the story was already portrayed just yeah. fine, and it's it's amazing what they can do. Maybe with some nuances that we were able to get from reading it. Names. But, sure. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think uh, it's wonderful. Um, um, the set is uh, gorgeous. Um, it really uh, put you in the mood of the story. Oh. Well, yes. Uh, the set made you feel like where you it's happening yeah. put you back into the um, period yeah and um, I'm so excited that we uh, get to see Giselle uh, in Portland for you know now it's been a long time did you probably already heard that all the costumes and sets came from Florence Italy yes. yeah out of control stunning I heard now so at first I, you didn't get to watch it I, well, we have to set up, you know, to get ready. So we watched it on the closed circuit TV okay, over okay. here, and you could, you know, I'm yeah. sure that it didn't do it justice, but it looked amazing. <laughs> you got a sense of how amazing it was. But you know, at first I thought maybe it was Florence, Oregon, and, you know, just like on some little. That's not nearly as impressive. Little more Pendleton fabrics there. Yeah, yeah. I wonder how much gas it costs to lug a set up from Florence, Oregon. Yeah. It's much more impressive to come from. <laughs> It's much more impressive that it comes from Florence, Italy, right? Yeah. Uh, it's so nice to uh, hear live music and see the dancer dance with live music. It's totally different, you oh. know, to see their movement with the music versus, uh, you know, tape or... Oh, yeah, the give and take is yeah, so, much, so, so much so yeah. much nicer. And so the choreography, I understand, came from the original Giselle. And, and was supplemented by the choreographer. Yeah. I think Christopher changed it a little bit to make it a little bit more modern and simplify a little bit so it's not so long. And then he had Lola de Avila in also. Right. Lola um, being um, so experienced with the show, the Giselle before, helped right. uh, tremendously with uh, working with the dancers. and. You know, I read up about it before I went, so uh, saw that she contributed a lot to the uh, the dance, the, the choreography, and the numbers. You know, every time I see a ballet, I cry. I I didn't cry, but I really into um, uh, the emotion. Um, uh, for me, it's seeing the performance of each dancer, how hard they're working, and it, they make it so simple. Even though it is, you really know it's so hard. But they make it like it's it's nothing, and that's the skill of the uh, dancers that we don't appreciate always. It's such an emotional experience for the audience, though. It's really beautiful. Well, my thank you so thank much. You.